For those of you who collect bobbleheads like myself, you either have to go to a professional sports game, a um, sports memorabilia store, or head to the internet to find them. And I usually do all three. And recently I was on eBay and I found a Cincinnati Bengals bobblehead that piqued my interest. It was an autographed David Fulcher bobblehead. And it just came in the mail and I took it out of the big brown box already. As you can see, uh, nothing too special about it, so well, I'm gonna talk about it on this unboxing video like I usually do with the Red Stadium Giveaway bobblehead uh, unboxing videos because those boxes actually do look pretty cool. And uh, what I pulled out of the big brown box, however, was a smaller white box. And I'm not sure if this was the actual box the bobblehead came in or if the guy who packaged it just put it in here. But we're gonna, if you guys know, feel free to leave a comment to let me know because I really like to know if this is the actual box or if the guy just put it in here. I'm not really sure. But yeah, so uh, the way the guy wrapped it in bubble wrap, it doesn't really fit in the box, so hopefully I can get it out without breaking the bobblehead because that would be a bad thing to happen on a bobblehead unboxing video. So gently sliding this out of the white box. He wrapped it pretty securely in this bubble wrap, I must say, so, the guy who sold this, thanks. And here it is. Here's David Fulcher autographed Cincinnati Bengals bobblehead. That looks pretty cool, I must say I like it. Uh, there's the autograph on the base, David Fulcher signature. The orange base, black letters, black traditional Bengals uniform, uh, there's his name on the back and yeah this is pretty cool uh, if you guys find something like this on eBay I'll definitely pick it up as this is the first and only time I'd ever seen this type of David Fulcher bobblehead on the internet as usually there's one with him in an orange Bengals uniform but this one was autographed and I had to jump on it it was too good of a deal to pass up so uh, make sure you keep it tuned to the Cincy Fans and YouTube channel and blog because you know I'm going to review this sometime in the future.